Guys, we're back. Early morning. There's a message on my phone. It's my mind. As this chaos begins to settle, Shelby manages to free herself from the rubble that had trapped her inside the Bill's house. Disoriented and shaken, she emerges into the open air, her heart pounding with a mixture of relief and dread. But as this she takes in the scene around her, her relief turns to concern as she realises that Victor Malgrave is nowhere to be found. Panic rises with her chest as she scans the air, searching desperately for the sight of her husband amidst the wreckage. Where's Victor? Harvey's voice cuts through the chaos. His eyes scanning the scene with a sense of urgency, like, oh god. Shelby's heart sinks as she meets his gaze. Her throat tightening with fear as she struggles to find the words to answer his question. I don't know, she replies, her voice barely above a whisper as the gravity of the situation sinks in. I haven't seen him since, since the explosion. As the realisation dawns upon them that Victor is missing, a sense of unease settles over the grip. Questions swirl in their minds, each one more troubling than the last. Where could Victor be? Could he have survived the explosion or has he met a fate far worse? With each passing moment, the uncertainty weighs up heavily upon them, casting a shadow over their relief at having escaped the devastation of God. And each, as they stand amidst the wreckage, their minds fill with worry and dread. They know that their journey is far from over and that the trip of Victor's fate may be more terrifying than they could have ever imagined. Guys, and that's it for this week. Monday will be the tr oh my god, what am there? Monday will be the truth of what really happened to Victor. Is he dead? Is he alive? Who died? Like the finale is still week on Monday, bro. Oh my god, this is such a long trip. In. <laughs> like it's just been like nearly three weeks. Wherever the thing, but guys, it'll be worth it. I don't know. This is a to be continued.